See? Yeah. She makes nice pitches, make, make, make good pitches. He had a bad pitch to Cole, but he hit that one in the gap. He got the run off him on that. Um, other than that, he pitched really good. Removed him there in the eighth inning. Just uh, felt the matchup. I didn't think they'd take Blanco out, and I thought the left on left matchup was the best way to go to get out of that inning. And then we matched up in the ninth inning, and they got three more runs, and that, that really hurt us. You know, you're just hoping you can hang in there <clears throat> and, and get the guy like Bumgarner. He was exceptional. May, maybe the best I've ever seen him. Seemed like uh, you know, his cutter was excellent. Uh, he's throwing his fastball wherever he wanted to. Curveball was good, and threw in some changeups as well. But I think his curveballs. It's as good as I've seen it uh, as many times we've seen him so far. So, pitched a good game. You got to hold him down, and we couldn't do that. What have you seen in Mike the, the second time up now? What's he, what's he done a little bit better? Well, I just think he's matured a bit. You know, he was up here the first time, got a taste, went down there, worked on some things. It's just all about locating your pitches. You can see there's something about him hiding the ball. He gets, you're looking up there, seeing 80, 80, 89 miles an hour. Um, but the swings tell you that it's something different. You know, he's, he's, he has some deception about him. He has some movement about him, and he's pretty good at moving the ball around as well. You think that stint, though, really kind of helped him? Uh, much well, it's not going to hurt. You know, you come up there, you go down, and then you're better prepared the next time you come up than you are the first time. Okay.